Welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you the process of installing and registering the software for AstroKit. Airbag service tool and smart OBD CAM tool for the Airbag River, which includes Airbag service tool, which I will call AST from now. It is exactly software with USB dongle. Flat ribbon cable for connecting the Airbag module. Smart OBD CAM tool and 12 volts power supply to power Smart OBD CAM tool. So what should you do after you get your new AST kit? I will answer this question to you in this video. First of all you should do unboxing, but you will not find there any manual or CD pen drive, something like that with software. Why? Because currently all over the world software updates change really so fast. There are no tools provided together with the software anymore. That's why we need to download software and drivers from internet. And traditionally show you how to download from alternative server and manufacturer as well. So let's go then to the website visible on the screen. Then sign in with the credentials provided above and click Open Fi Server. Now let's go to the CarProtool category. Software. This is what we need now, so click to go there. Actually we need the first two from the top, but also briefly I will tell you about the rest of them. Airbag can service tool. AST software running only with USB dongle. It is for erase crash data on the bench and OBD if you use smart OBD of course. Airbag service tool by dump. Just a typical calculator to work on the bench. And clears crash data from airbag modules only from dump files. And please note that this software doesn't work with Smart OBD and the module memory cannot be read by OBD with the software. CarProtool Programmer. This is an EEPROM programmer software. You can read, write the EEPROM memory. Dashboard Service Tool. The software comes with USB dongle and Smart OBD plug and is used for mileage correction and adjustment. You can also change service data. You can turn the tachygraph off or on and also sync the dash with the electronic ignition switch. Emo service tool. In short, it is an immobilizer code and a pin calculator from the dump files. Of course, comes with a USB dongle. You can disable immobilizers in supported ECU and also renew to virgin. They will be like brand new. Key service tool. This comes with USB dongle and smart OBD tool and is used to reset and reuse old car keys. I mean resetting old keys to virgin. That's it about the software. As I said, we need two first. Airbag can service tool and airbag service tool by dump. The software is no need to be installed. Just create a folder in any place of your hard drive, for example desktop, extract all files and run. Ok, let's run the software. And here we will stop for a moment. Let me explain what is about. Uh, here we got information that the USB dongle was not found. And here should be just USB dongle serial number and the red background just indicated that it is not connected yet. At this point we got information that the smart OBD wasn't detected. So what are we doing then? We need to insert first USB dongle into an available USB port. Please note, in most cases Windows will detect, download and install the right drivers. If it doesn't, you will have to download the drivers and install them yourself. As you can see, the dongle has been installed. And here we can see that this device is in demo mode with 10 tries left. Now we see USB dongle serial number and how many days we have to do buy another subscription for the next year, after registration of course. And information, 10 units left, which means we have 10 tries before we register the software. Ok, let's go on. Now please attach smart OBD using USB cable and click refresh.
As you can see, Smart OBD has been detected and virtual USB serial port has been assigned to it. And basically, we can start work now, but however, it is recommended to register right after installation, so let's go to registration. Now please fill in the form. There where is name, just put your business name or your first and second name. And there where is your email, just put your email twice and click OK. The registration process takes literally a few seconds. After successful registration, we receive the message registration completed. That's it, that's everything. Let me tell you just a few things at the end. Regarding updates, the software check them automatically on startup. The current software version is always visible on the top bar. You can also check it manually by clicking on the check new version button. What else do you need to know? The software requires an internet connection to work. No remote assistance software can be running in the background while working with the software. So if you have TeamViewer on any desk, you have to turn them off. You can also use the discussion forum in English. The link is visible on the screen and in the description on this video. Also in the description below you can find links to our stores and contact with us. Let us know in the comments by clicking the thumbs up or down in the video was helpful or not. Thank you for watching and to the next video. Cheers!